Campers, George here, and just wanted to go over something with you that I just got. Um, I was looking online, never a good thing for me, and was shopping around looking for something and came across this guy. And basically what it is, is a portable folding shovel, multi-tool, survival tool, whatever you, you want to call it. And what I was looking for online was a shovel for my truck. Winter is here in Minnesota. The snow is coming. We have a storm coming this weekend. I don't want to get stuck anywhere. And decided I needed a, a, a sturdy shovel. I do have a big snow shovel, black one. It's made out of a, a hard plastic that I can use to shovel snow. But if I get into a rut somewhere, I doubt if I could dig out with it. It's not really designed for that. So I was looking for a shovel for that. And I came across this guy and it's from OnTrip Military Portable Folding Shovels. Um, and it's basically a, a survival tool is what it is. And it's not very big once it's all folded up. It's pretty small. It's fairly nice. You can see my hand. It's about six inches by about four inches, which is not bad. And uh, comes in a nice bag and it's all packs in there nicely. Here you have the shovel head and you have uh, three parts of the handle. And you can see them here. And the bag is fairly sturdy. It uh, has little inserts inside to hold everything. It's a black material, so it's kind of hard to see, but um, it's sturdy enough, I think, to handle it. it. Uses a Velcro over the for the flap. It does have a shoulder strap, and it does allow you to put onto a, a belt or something like that, so you can carry it on your belt. It's actually not that big, and I don't think it'll be that much of a problem, although the whole thing is kind of heavy. Anyway, what I wanted to go through you, with you was uh, each little piece that comes with it and what they offer with it. Are they all handy? Do they work? Um, I think in certain situations they would work for a survival situation. Anything that can help you is a good thing. The main reason I got it, I needed a good shovel and I figured why not have some multi-tools in it as well. So uh, the three handles go together like this. You have a compass on the end and on this one you have a tool which comes out and gives you a Phillips head and a flat head screwdriver. Uh, I suppose it would be handy to have. The handle's kind of big. Getting into a small place on your vehicle or something like that might be a little difficult, but you could use it for repairs. More of an urban survival type situation. And it does have the, camp, the, the compass in the handle which screws off. Um, it's a pretty basic compass. And it kind of works. It works pretty well. I checked it out with my military compass and it's pretty accurate. Um, and here you have a ferro rod and you can use obviously something to strike with it. Um, how well it will work, I'm not sure I didn't use it. Uh, I do have so many of them and I do have in my vehicle already. So it's nice to have. Um, it does have a little bit extra storage space in there when you put this back on. So that's uh, what I call the butt end of the handle. Um, and then, oh, sorry, I put that on the wrong side. That's going to be a problem for me. This actually goes right into the handle and this it goes on there. On there. So it goes on there. And then the second one here does have a um, glass breaker, I suppose you'd call it, with some storage space in there where the screwdriver uh, goes into. It does screw together. This is pretty solid. It's a solid, strong handle, which did impress me. I was worried about that. Um, and then, of course, the glass breaker goes into this, which is a saw with a knife blade and the spearhead, fishing head is what I would call it, with a bottle opener on it. And uh, that goes on here. You can see they, they do screw together pretty well nice and sturdy and then of course this goes into the shovel head like that now the shovel head 
does have its own cover which is probably a good thing because it does have some sharp edges on it and uh, it's a little messy right now because I was out playing with it earlier um, digging and trying out different things with it so there's your shovel head um, and this screws up and holds it in place so you'd screw that up and it locks it in place for a regular shovel and then if you want to use it as a hoe style where you're going to dig in um, and I did try that you can see the videos as I go through um, screws down and then back in again which will hold it in that position for the hoe so and it is solid it is very solid the way I like the way that works um, so the handle here with the saw and the knife blade etc on it just screws into there and here you can see the whole shovel and on the shovel itself you do have uh, a saw tooth on the top here which is kind of like a blade saw tooth type thing as a bottle opener a tool thing here for undoing bolts you're limited to what size you're going to handle obviously never understood this unless you're going to give the whole range of sizes it's kind of hit and miss and then it does have a blade here a chopping blade so you can chop down on it um, a nice thing it does have and I don't know if you can see that but it actually has measurements across there very solid um, like the way it work I did try it out you saw what I was doing uh, through the movie so uh, there you go I like this it's very solid and this will definitely be going in my truck um, something to consider if you live in a, uh, an area that has bad weather and you don't want to get stuck slide off the road you've got to dig yourself out something like that which is a pretty common occurrence here in Minnesota um, I've seen uh, more than my fair share of uh, vehicles on the side of the road so there you go and this is the military survival folding shovel um, it's uh, this one comes from on trip and I got it on uh, uh, online at Amazon, of course. <laughs> and uh, not bad, 33 bucks. Um, sounds like a lot of money, but I think it's going to last. It's sturdy. I really like it. So I've got the handles on here. Give you an idea of the size of it. Um, and you can see it there. And the handle is solid nothing shakes it goes together well so not bad will it work I don't know let's check it out I'll try some things with it quickly Not bad. It's solid. The handle works well. I was worried about the handle, but it's solid. And the head as well. And the way it adjusts here, you've got a lot of strength right here, which is a good thing. 
overall not bad. So there you go, the on-trip military folding shovel and survival tool. Thanks for watching. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe. You know the story. And uh, put a comment below. That will always be a good thing. Uh, let me know what you think of this idea. And if you know of any others that are maybe better or comparative to this. And I'm sure I'll be back again. Just saying. Bye.